Why are you being so impossible? I'm a teen. Hello, how's my daughter's only friend? Mom. When I read this, I thought, oh my god, this is a gem. I was really taken by how real the characters are and how human. What are you doing? Rehearsing for my blasting death metal phase. Unless hip hop freaks you out more. This freaks me out. Great. Anyone can relate to this. I think lots of mothers and daughters have the same relationship as Grace and Ansiedad. I play a 13-year-old girl who feels neglected by her mother and I seek a rite of passage as a way to jumpstart my adulthood and leave her along with my childhood behind. Hey. What the hell? What the, how'd you get my car? Girl secret. I have this list of things I need to do. Want to help? You with what? Mm. A first kiss. You want me to be your first kiss? But it has to be awkward and clumsy, and I have to hate it. All right. It's tough to go through being a teenager because there are so many problems that we go through. And I think this film definitely just shows you exactly what everybody goes through and how you can survive it. You put this in my locker? That's right. Why? Because I want to be like you. One of you guys. Who knows says you can get alcohol? You think I can't? Hmm? You chest nerd? I want to be like you. <laughs> That's funny. I think that Ansi, that she's a 13 year old girl who just doesn't know really who she is. And I think that anyone can relate to that. Where the heart of the movie lies is that everything at the end has love behind it. Despite all the conflict, there's the underlying love. Everyone needs that reassurance that someone's there and they care for you. And sometimes growing up means acting your age. 